really sad day. So in all of our calculations, we didn't take into account how long the flipping pole is. Hey guys, so I am here with Brandon. Hello. We are at Cheesecake Factory at the Grove and we just got our lunch. I got the herb crusted salmon. Look how big that is. That is like Look seven salmon filet. fish on one. And then it has mashed potatoes and grilled asparagus in a lemon sauce and he got... I got chicken piccata. Um, I'm not even sure what that was until Blair told me. It's like chicken with a lemon and garlic sauce and fun noodles and like, what is this called? I don't know. Some but leaves. It, yeah, <laughs> some, some leaves. leaves to garnish it. <laughs> it's just pretty leaves. Yeah. You know, I just like leaves on my food. Yeah, <laughs> I do too. So we are having lunch right now and then what are we gonna do? I don't know. We should walk around like the, the Grove or something. Yeah, we'll walk around the Grove. I mean, I want to see Mama so bad. We have, we have to wait for Remy. Yes. We have to wait for Remy. You guys have to go see Mama. I know. We really want to see Mama, but Remy wants to see it, and she's not coming back to LA till Wednesday. I'm so sad. So we're waiting on her. So yeah, I'm probably not gonna lie. I'm gonna get some things for my room today. Ooh, can I I'm, help? Yeah. Ooh. I am like so obsessed with it. Don't you love it though? Her room is literally like the cutest I've ever seen. It is so fresh. Like, if it was my house, I would, that would be my house, pretty much. Exactly the same. Is it good? This is really good. Okay, we're, we're gonna, gonna go ahead and eat. Four. We will talk to you guys in a little bit. Where are we going now? We're going to the world market. I feel like I can't get me in the frame and you in the frame at the same time, because like you're this. so tall. I have to walk with my knees hunched. How tall are you, like six five? Almost six five. We are heading over to world market to see what they have over there, see if there's anything that we want to pick up. And I want to go into Zara. No. Yes, let's no, go to Zara. No, I feel, I'm spending money on redecorating okay. my room. I don't need to be spending Rock, money. Rock, scissors. Okay, okay we'll do both. Okay, because <laughs> you know I win. I got oh that skill. Goodness. Okay, so yeah, we are going to go ahead and head on over to- Can we go to Zara first or World Market first? World Market. Okay. I'm okay. going to get aloe vera juice. Aloe vera juice? Wait, is it? Aloe vera? Aloe vera? That green stuff with the little chunks in it. Yo. It's good for you. <laughs> it's like, that sounded really gross, I'm sorry. <laughs> like the, the white stuff with chunks in it. I'm, not, I'm just gonna end that. <laughs> I'm sorry. That totally makes me want it was still to drink bad. that. Guys, we're not quite sure if this camera's focused or if either of us are in the frame right now, but we are just now leaving the Grove. We went to World Market and I got two pictures for my bathroom. Super they're, cute. they're super cute and they're a lot less expensive than if I would have gone with the, um, the Pier 1 like mirrored things. So I've decided I think my bathroom's done now. I'm going to see what they look like when they're in there and we're going to nail them in. Yeah, we're going to have a tea party. That's going to be weird. So we were going to Sprinkles Cupcakes Ta -da! and what happened Brandon? Okay, so we're in line with Sprinkles Cupcakes and I'm trying to get my money out and I was like which cupcake should I get? I'm like, should I get the German chocolate? And she's like, no, I think you should choose whatever one, which one would be better in the bedroom. And this girl next to us was like, <laughs> did that whole eye raise thing was like, better in the bedroom. And I'm like, that sounded super sexual. And I she's like, yeah, it did. <laughs> because we talked about how we were gonna have an Instagram tea party and we're gonna like, <laughs> am I still recording? Ah! Sorry about You're that. Cupcake. Ah! Yeah. But. So we were talking about how we were going to have an Instagram tea party in the bedroom <laughs> while we're hanging up my <laughs> curtains and um, we're going to attempt to hang up the curtains. I hung up Remy's curtains though and I'm not going to lie, I'm pretty I'm pretty good with good the power curtains? screwdriver. You're good with the screwdriver. The power screwdriver, <sighs> Brandon. It has to be electric. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, no, but... So we were like, yeah, it'll be super cute. We'll put our, our sprinkles cupcakes on a plate and like light a candle and take a picture and Instagram it and <laughs> then eat them while we hang curtains. So he was asking me which one he should get, like German chocolate or vanilla. And I was just like, which whichever one looks better in the bedroom. <laughs> and the girl was like, eyebrow raise. I was like, that's not what I meant. And she was like, oh, it's okay, honey. It's okay. We all have those days. And I was like, we do? As we were leaving, she looked at me and she winked at me too on the way out. Oh. Little does she know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It was so funny. Um, so yeah, I picked up the curtains. I actually got them, don't laugh at me, but I got them at Pottery Barn Kids. But I think they have the same like curtains because they're just plain white with ruffles. So you'd think that they would be like kitty, but actually 
Um, they're very sheer. They're, they're nice. Yeah, they're sheer. They're really, really cute. But they're the same ones that they have on pbteen.com. And I believe they even have them on potterybarn.com, like the adult one. Because they're just like plain sheer ruffles. And they look just like ones that Anthropology has. So I really don't think that they're going to look too little kiddish in my room so i'm really excited i think it's going to give some texture but remain white hi teddy bear so teddy has found a new spot that he loves i put him on the bed and he went right in the middle of the pillows oh. you love it look how sleepy his eyes look he's like this is a life so here's the curtain rod i have my my power screwdriver brand oh these are the pictures that oh, i got these are the pictures how cute are they we got so, these at the world market right yeah world market and those are going in my bathroom what is on my foot ready i'm so scared wait do you drill straight in or do i need to drill the hole and then this because with remy's we had to drill the hole and then put the screw in uh wait isn't there a screw that goes into that yeah i think you drill that first then so you drill that and then you put the screw into that right because that looks like a drill thing. Oh, I didn't check for studs. What does that mean? I can't tell a difference. Can you? I've never I've studs. never been able to tell a difference. If, ah. if not, I can do it. I have muscles that are huge. <laughs> oh? There we go. Ah. Oh, look at this. Ah. There's all the stuff coming out of ah. there. Is that supposed to happen or did I just break my Oh wow. Oh, did you grab your TV? Yeah. <laughs> Brandon, is that supposed to happen? Um, oh my god, I'm scared. I think it went Hold a on. little sideways. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna get dust everywhere. Well look and then it. you put this on here, right? Yeah, but look it, you have to have that fully against flat against the wall. It doesn't go any further. I think it does. I think you just have to like twist it. Oh. See? Almost. I think maybe it could go a little more. I don't think it can. I think I put it inside. No, nope, look, it told you. Haha. -ha. Brandon is the right person. Ooh. Okay. Right. That's as much as I can do. I think okay. that's pretty good. Now we gotta do the other one. This is Picture Hanging 101. First thing you need is a power tool. I like the um, power screwdriver and drill from Ikea and then you're gonna need to get your curtain rods that come with your little applicator things <laughs> and is that what that's called? That's I, what that's I think called. it's called like a drill thingy. Okay. Are you supposed to drill at an angle? No, drill, I think, no, not bottom like that, yeah. Because if you go bottom it will go in sideways. Somebody's definitely gonna comment on how wrong we are. I know. Ugh. It's going, it's going. It's hard. Get it, there it is. Oh, hold on. Wow. That doesn't look right. Undrill it. Wait, undrill it. No. Yeah, because you have to take all that stuff out. <laughs> I think I just messed everything up. It's fine. <laughs> Crap. Teddy, back up. You're going to die if you stay over here. Oh, wait, that little silver part. Where is it? Where did it go? <laughs> This is a fail. There it is. <laughs> Power drilling with a female fail. This is amazing. I'm sure some females are really good at this. I'm glad we're getting this Just on camera. Not me. <laughs> yeah. This is right, right? I think so. I think you're doing pretty good. If my painters saw this right now, they'd be yeah, so mad. I think he'd be pretty upset with me. I mean, he did such a good job painting this room. I know. And you're just drilling it away. <gasps> Stop falling! You're making me nervous. I think Blair's going a little, um, just a tiny bit into the wall. <laughs> Look at that. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that was so funny. Thanks, Brandon. You had vetted me. Pull the camera. I'm gonna keep filming this until we're done. No, I'm just kidding. Ah. Get it! That's right. Oh crap. I just think the power drill is like not super strong enough. Well, you're supposed to charge it and I oh, haven't Oh, you haven't charged it yet. But if it's working, it doesn't need to be charged. Look at that. That's pretty flat, right? That's pretty flat. Guys, I don't even know if this is right. 
Well, I, I guess we'll find out. All of this up. Here, try and put this in. Okay, but I need to get these screws now. Whoa. Okay. The lighting looks really good with this color on the wall. I know, I like it. Oh! As Wait. a YouTuber, you appreciate I know. I'm not gonna lie, Brandon, you kind of scare me. No, I'm good at things that are for men. <laughs> Don't do that, I. Don't do that, I. I'm good at men things. I used to play football. Ooh, that is good. I used to play football and I used to do track and field. And guess what, Blair? What? I helped build a shed. Really? Yeah, a whole shed. I'm not completely inefficient. Uh oh. Oh wait, you're just not in the hole. You're gonna strip it. Don't strip it. Are you supposed to just be able to twist it in, or do you need to screw it in? No, I need to screw that. Should thing. I stop recording? I did one corner. You can see it up there. It actually turned out, um, but I'm too tired to do the other one. So Brandon and I decided we were going to take a cupcake break, and we lit a candle. That's so cute. Because <laughs> we want to have a tea party without Teddy tea. wants to join. Teddy, you want to join? Uh, join. <laughs> join. Yeah. He's wondering. Um, so I got red velvet and he got vanilla, vanilla sprinkles. With sprinkles. And then we have our candle. What you think? He like gets as close as he can to me. Um, yeah, so can you guys see that up there? I actually did a pretty good job. We almost fell like six times, but don't worry, I'm here. I'm a tall guy, so I can catch. He did. He caught me a couple I, times. I it can was catch. <laughs> it was it was she was like deal. drilling it in and she Oh yeah, and then I stood on the um, dresser. <laughs> yeah, because I thought it would be a good idea. So we're going to enjoy our cupcake. Really sad day. So in all of our calculations, we didn't take into account how long the flipping pole is. So it doesn't quite reach that side. On a side note, though, I mean, I have to really say, cute. these curtains are really cute, and it looks like they're hung at the perfect height. Look how cute they are. We so just need to get a longer rod now. What do we do? I think we just need to buy a longer rod. Well, what if we... It was like four inches off. Why didn't I think of that? I don't like, know why either of us didn't think of that. We're like, so proud of our like drilling powers. I didn't think about how far off it would be. Well, can I get, can I keep these up here and just get a different color pole? Yeah. I have a different, I have a white pole. It won't be as cute because that's like kind of Cream. creamy. Hold on, I have one downstairs. Oh my God. This is just not for us, you guys. So I finally got this pole from downstairs. It's what I used to use um, in between like my valance or whatever. And then... Brandon picks up this pole and two other poles fall out and he goes, what the hell? What's that? There's three of them. There's three of them. It's going to fit. Okay. Uh, time to go again. OMG. But how cute are the curtains? It does look really cute though. I think they're really, really adorable. And I think, I think the pole's pretty straight, you guys. Like, I think so. I mean, it dips in the middle just a tiny that's just a, bit. And that's just because it's like not a strong pole. Yeah, it's a really cheapo pole. I got it. I think it was like $4 at Target. I'm not even exaggerating that, guys. It was super cheap. So let's try to put this one on. This fits way more than we need. So that pole goes all the way from there to there. What were we doing? We were just an idiot mode. We just didn't pull the other side out. We only pulled one side out. I oh, said that too. I'm like, doesn't this side come out? And I'm like, oh wait, never mind. Yeah, I know. Oh my goodness. Wow. Okay, well, let's take the cheapo broken pull down. And we're going to nice one up. Yeah. Upsy daisies, wavy daisies. Do, 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 do. After however many minutes, we finally, uh, that probably took us like an hour and a half, wouldn't you say? I would say probably an hour and a half to put curtains up. <laughs> yep. Um, so hold on, I'm gonna fix these a little bit. I can't so, it so good. I know it really does. It so so that is our masterpiece, and I want to get those little things that can like hold it back like that if I want to. But um, yeah, I think you should that... get the little knobs in like ac your accent color in like a like, like a pool blue. blue. Yeah, that'd be so cute. Yeah, it would. Oh, wow. I feel so proud. I know. They're so cute! And look at the middle doesn't bend like the old raggedy pole. Yeah, the middle's but, straight. That's look awesome. Look how straight what that you is. doing, Pinecone? What you doing, Coney? Pinecone's chilling like a villain. Pinecone loves it up there. It's because he's got his eye on the world. You know? What you looking at? What did she see something? <gasps> what is it? Teddy, what is it? Are you jealous? Yeah, I'm sorry. Jelly belly. Teddy, you can get in your little bottom one. 
Okay, I'm sorry. So I believe my bathroom, other than maybe just doing a little curtain up there, I believe it's done. We got these two little pictures from World Market and they're super, super cute. And then I just need to get a few more rocks to fill this up a little higher. And I'm pretty sure we're good to go. I went against the idea of doing a chandelier decal a lot of you were like it doesn't make sense since it's going to be like steamy from hot baths and showers and stuff so i was like oh that's a good idea and then i saw these and i was like that's perfect and it might just be too cluttered if i do it over here as well so i think when you walk in and you just see this i think it's very pretty and just clean and crisp and i love it so we hung those up and i didn't have a hammer so brandon what did we use a stiletto. We used the stiletto as a hammer and it worked so perfectly. And then over here, we went ahead and hung up this as well. I think after it was on the wall, we realized it really does need some picture frames, like a collage around it and stuff. But I was really proud that we were able to hang that up and earthquake secure it and stuff like that. So unless that whole wall comes down, that little buddy is staying up there. That took us like two hours, but... I think it's really pretty and I already took the pillows off my bed because Brandon's about to head out and I'm going to go to sleep. So yeah, I'm excited. Bye guys.